What's up, everybody? How you doing? My name is Corey Sanders. I go by the name of Tall Boy, and this is the Tall Boy Experience. I have two questions for you. Do, do you like the live stream? Number one, and number two, would you like to capture two sources, two HDMI's on one device? Well, today we're going to talk about the JVA06, brought to you by J5 Create. Stay tuned. Do you want the experience? Of course. Tall boy got the experience. He a bad man. You see how he interview? If you want the experience, there's only one way you're going to get it. And that's through Tall Boy. He's going to bring it any way you want it. Be open for it. Oh my goodness. Hey everybody, you're watching Tall Boy. If you want the experience, nobody but Tall Boy can do it. Watch out there now. Say what? Tall Boy going to give it to you. You feel what I'm saying? That's what he told me to say. If you want the exclusive, you want the tall boy, because he's going to bring you the exclusive. What's up, everybody? My name is Corey Tallboy Sanders. A lot of folks just know me as Tallboy because I've always been known to interview uh, influencers and celebrities. But now I'm getting into the tech space, and I want to talk to you about live streaming. I want to talk to you about capture cards, cameras, uh, laptops, all that crazy good old stuff that make live streaming work. Well, today, before you do anything to make live streaming work, yes, you need a camera. Yes, you need a laptop. Yes, you need a microphone. But you need one key thing, and that is a capture card. And we're going to talk about this baby right now. So, J5 Create was nice enough to send this over to me. It's called the JVA06. I don't know if you can see it right there. But before we even get into that, let's talk a little bit about live stream. You know, one, you can live stream right from your phone, of course, or you can do browser based, which is where you log on to a website such as StreamYard or a Restream, and you can live stream right there. Or if you want to get a little technical, then you can turn around and do what I'm doing right now, which is live streaming multiple. Uh, devices and equipment um, to make it all work. So let me put this on the screen right now and show you what I'm talking about. So you have the camera, of course, to make you live stream. And before you do any of that, you have to have the HDMI cable. You gotta be able to put the camera on the tripod. You gotta have a laptop to make it work. So, you know, before you do any live stream, you gotta make all that work. Then you gotta have a microphone. Gotta have live streaming software such as vMix, there's OBS, there's Camp Actors, and there's XSplit. So you gotta have live streaming equipment. Whatever that equipment is for you, that's on you. But to make it all work, bring the camera into the laptop, you gotta have that JBA06 of the capture card. And that's what we're gonna talk about right now. That's this thing right here, okay? So with that being said, I have this here and I'm going to switch and I'm going to show you what it is. So two sources on this one device. So most people, you're accustomed to seeing the, JV, you're accustomed to seeing a normal capture card, shall I say, this one device plugged in HDMI. And when you plug it in HDMI, run that to your camera and you run it into your laptop. And that's what allows you to stream. But with this product here, you can now do this. So I have two sources. So I have two cameras hooked up right now. And the cool thing is this one also offers picture in picture. So if I wanted to, did I do it right? Well, no, not yet. So if I wanted to do this, I can move around with this JV06 picture in picture. So just imagine you have a cooking show and you want to show the food, but you also want to talk. This would be a great use case, something like that. Also, I'm back by pressing the A button because I have my main camera into A and then I also have my second camera into B. So that's what you see there down, down here at the bottom. Now, what I also found out that was pretty cool is you can do side by side. Now, you have to press a and the B button together at the same time. And if you do that, you get a split screen 
you can see not only yourself, but you can also see that second camera. And if you want a tighter shot, you bring it in closer by hitting the button right there. Now, one of the also some of the other cool things that I saw was it has a microphone uh, uh, input to where you can plug a 3.5 millimeter jack in. And when you plug that 3.5 millimeter jack, uh, which is your audio source, you can plug that in and then you now get audio from your, not only your camera, but you can also bring in an external microphone. And you also have on the other side, the headphones um, that you can plug into. That way you can monitor your audio, whether it's coming from camera one or camera two or your microphone. So that's kind of where these buttons are right here. So as you can see, I'm talking on camera one and you can see the lights go up right now on that camera here. Now I'm going to slide over and try and turn this microphone on and show you a little bit about what that external mic can do. And it would be the same for camera two to have the audio going in from there as well. So that's one of the features that I saw that this product has. Now also two cold hot shoe uh, mounts or adapters, DSLR, so you can live stream and broadcast your webinars. You can hook that cold shoe up to, which is up at the top and what's also plugged in here at the bottom onto my tripod here. You can have both of these plugged uh, in to where you can use for um, one for the adapter here and then maybe you, um, for your tripod here at the bottom and then also at the top you can use that for another device um, that you can use for this over here. All right. Now, one of the other cool things that I saw was remember this is just one source. So most laptops have only three uh, or four or USB ports. Well, you're plugging in one USB and you're getting two cameras or two sources. So whether that's a monitor, whether that's a video game, whether that's a camera, whatever the case may be, you're getting two sources in one. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. So I, I, that's one thing that I love about this J5 uh, Create JVA06. So I'm going to switch over that I have the right one and we're going to come out of it and then I'm back to normal. So now I'm back on camera one. This is now camera two. And then if I wanted to have my, oh, that's this, this is camera two. And then if I wanted to have the picture in picture, if I wanted it in the lower third on my bottom left, I can have it here. I can hit the button again and then it'll send me to the top left, hit it again. And it, pretty much does it in clockwise formation. Same thing is if I go here for camera one, and then I want camera two to be my lower, and I can literally press go over here. Now the one good thing about this that I love or that I saw that was pretty cool is you can record or you can stream 60 frames per second. Now that 60 frames, now you have the option to have uh, slow motion capabilities, um, you have the option to do a lot of, uh, fast forward or slow, put in sl basically it's more for slow motion, shall I say. And that's the one cool thing about that. So it's 1080 over 60, um, capture via, via HDMI. All right. So I want to let you know about that. Now the pricing for this, I went to J Vibes website and when I went to their website, um, I saw that, um, they had, if I can find it, J5's website, this is what it retails for. It retails for $239, or you can go over to uh, Amazon, and Amazon has the same pricing as well um, on, their, on their website. So if that's something that you're looking for, feel free. I'll put the link in the description 
where you can purchase it on Amazon, or you can go over to J5 Creates website and you can see it right there. Um, this is a pretty cool device. I mean, two devices in one. I mean, you really just can't beat that. I mean, that's that. I mean, you just you just can't. I mean, I'm sorry. Um, the Madwell's uh, capture cards that everybody talks about. They retail for two ninety nine. You're getting this for two hundred and thirty nine dollars. So you're really saving some money. Um, so that's just something to think about. So if this is something that you guys are thinking about purchasing, make sure you look up J five Create JVA06 Dual HDMI Video Capture. And um, if this is something that you want, feel free um, to make that part happen. Um, that's pretty much it I mean it's the JVA06 I showed you what it could do um, it does come with quite naturally it comes with the manual it did come with cables, so you did get one HDMI cable also got um, USB to USB USB to USB a to plug into your laptop and you also got and uh, eight one one HDMI cable that came with this as well. All right. So that's all that came into this unit. So for $239, you get two sources for the price of one and you get cable. That's a good price or that's a good deal. So hopefully you enjoyed um, this review that I've talked about the dual HDMI capture card. If it's something that you guys would like to have, feel free to uh, jump on it. Um, here is a price comparison right now of what the Madwell versus what the um, JVA06 offers. And so you can see one source for the Madwell, two sources for the JVA06. All right. So that's something to think about as you go from there. So make sure you like, subscribe, and all that good old stuff on my page. I hope that you like it. It's called the JVA06 by J5 Create Dual HDMI Video Capture Card. If it's something that you need to make your streaming go a lot better, make it easier, or just to free up a USB port, think about this product right here. All right. Um, once again, my name is Tallboy. This is Tallboy Experience. I'm out. Y'all be good.